This year, Halloween fell on a weekend. Me and Ghetto Boys are trick or treating. What's good, people? Welcome to the Uptown Horror Review Show. Today, we are going to be reviewing Witch Island by David Bernstein. So, without further ado, let's just get right into it. All right, so this book opens up in the year 1904, right? This is this woman by the name of Margaret Rivers who has just moved into this upstate New York town, right? So she's living there with her husband on the outskirts of town, away from everyone. And we find out that this woman is a witch, right? But, but she's a friendly witch. Like, she's not out here uh, sacrificing children. She's not out here, uh, 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 you know, cutting goats' heads off or anything like that. All, all she really does is she goes to the woods and she she finds like herbs and fucking plants and flowers and shit and she just makes healing potions that's pretty much all she does you know she she's pretty much a hippie you know what i'm saying she's not hurting a damn soul okay so yo the the, the people in the town they get wind that she's a witch and before you know it they all wind up at her fucking front door with torches with fucking pitchforks and they're like yo margaret rivers you get out your house right now because we are going to burn you at the stake, right? So, yo, the, the first thing she does is she gets a shotgun. She opens the door and she just starts fucking capping everybody, right? One by one, she is just mowing them down, right? But what I'm saying is if, if, you, are, if you are the townspeople and you see this woman with a shotgun, she's supposed to be this big, powerful, this big, bad witch, and she has a shotgun... Doesn't that tell you that she isn't really a threat to you? You know what I'm saying? Like, if she was really a witch, all, all she would do is, like, wave a wand at you and turn you into, like, a, a fucking frog, or you know what I'm saying? Or make you disappear or something. She would not be using a regular weapon. You get what I'm saying? So, yo, they burn her house down. Her husband was in the... He was sick in, in the bed. They fucking burn him. Burn, burn the house down and, and fucking kill him in the process, right? So, yo, they take Margaret Rivers with them and they take it to this island, right? Because they have this theory that uh, a spirit cannot cross a body of water, right? So to prevent Margaret Rivers' spirit from coming back and trying to seek vengeance or whatever, we're going to uh, kill her on this island so that she can't come back. You know what I'm saying? So, yo, they all go to this island. They find the clearing in the middle of the woods, right, on this island. They like, yo, this is where we're going to kill her. So, yo, they, 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 they get this fucking massive stake. They put it right in the middle of the clearing. And they tie her to the stake. And they fucking burn her alive. Okay? This innocent fucking woman that ha hadn't... She hasn't hurt anyone, right? And they kill her fucking husband on top of that, right? So, yo, so as you can imagine, she's dead now. And her fucking spirit is just livid, man. She... she there is going to be reckoning, right? One way or a fucking other, okay? So, so another precaution that they take is they they get this, they do some type of magical incantation and they put these stakes all all around the perimeter of the clearing, right? And they're like, yeah, these stakes are here so that Margaret Rivers can't access her full power, right? As long as these stakes are in the ground, like whoever comes onto this island is relatively safe okay they like you know what i'm saying like is is keeping her at bay you get what i'm saying as long as those stakes are in the ground so yo so we got a time jump it is it is now present day okay and we 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 see that it is the last day of school at the town's high school right so all the all the seniors they like yo we going off to college next year like we we got to go all out we got to go out with a bang you know so you know what we're going to do? We're going to go right to Witch Island and we're going to prove to the town that there is no witch, right? Because their whole lives, they, they've been hearing their parents, their grandparents tell them like, yo, whatever you do, do not go to Witch Island if you know what's good for you, right? Stay far away from fucking Witch Island, right? So the kids are like, yo, we going off to college. We, we going to prove to everyone that there's no fucking witch. There's no fucking magical uh, uh, monster out there on that island. We, we going to go out there. We're going to have a good time and we're going to come back and nothing will have happened to us. Right. Yo, so they all get on a canoe. 
They fucking they 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 paddle over there to Witch Island. There's eight of them, right? They paddle over there to Witch Island. They come across the clearing where Margaret Rivers was killed, right? And these dumb motherfuckers, they like, wow, this is a perfect place to 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 you know hang out. So yo, they get their fucking lawn chairs, they fucking place them there, they they get a bonfire going, they start drinking and shit. And this this one girl, she's like a, a wannabe archaeologist, right? She sees the stakes in the ground, the, the the stakes all around the perimeter that's keeping Margaret at bay. She's a wannabe archaeologist, right? So she's like, wow, look look at these beautiful uh Look at these beautiful little uh, uh, artifacts on the ground, you know? I, I should take these and I should donate them to the museum or whatever, you know? Like, there, there's someone who could, uh, there's someone out there who would appreciate this, you know? So, like an idiot, they all start taking all the fucking, uh, what you call it? The fucking, the, the little stakes, they start taking them all out the ground one by one, man. And after the last stake is pulled out, Margaret Rivers is now at full maximum fucking power, man. She is ready to kick ass and take names. She's re she's ready to fuck. My bad, that was my phone. She's ready to fuck everybody up now, right? So yo, so she she has this ability where she could fucking she could possess people, right? So she'll just possess one person in the group. They'll kill two or three people, then she'll possess somebody else, and that's pretty much the whole book at that point, man. It's just like rinse and repeat. She's just possessing people, killing them, possessing somebody else. And that's just the whole book. You know what I'm saying? So, the, I don't know. For that reason, I wasn't too crazy about the book. Like, the whole time, once they're on the island and shit starts going down, the whole time, I'm waiting for something exciting to happen. You know, I'm waiting for, like, this big moment, this big fucking revelation about the witch or whatever. And the shit just never happens, man. I was expecting this shit to go out with a bang somehow, and it just goes out with a fucking fizzle. You get what I'm saying? So yeah, man. For, for that reason, I wasn't really too, I, I wasn't really too crazy about the book, man. But um, I, I'm not trying to stop you from reading it. You, you might read this, and it, you might fucking love it. You know what I'm saying? So that's my review, man. Witch Island, David Bernstein. I'm gonna give it a five out of ten. And with that, I'm out. I hope you like this video, I hope you leave a motherfucking comment, and I hope you please subscribe to my channel. I'm out.